I'm here at HPE Discover in Madrid with Mike Whitaker, and Superdome has a new Superdome Flex that's part of the, the uh, line of servers. Can you talk about what's different about that? Sure, yeah, we just launched the Superdome Flex uh, two weeks ago now, and we uh, it's really, what we've done is we've taken the in-memory technology from the SGI acquisition by HPE, combined that with the mission-critical features from the heritage of the HPE Superdome line into this new product family. And what, what the, one of the key things is, it's a modular architecture. So what this means is you can start small with a four socket building block, but you can grow very large. So in a single rack, we can put eight of these modules, 32 sockets, 48 terabytes. So basically it's set up to scale with to whatever your in-memory needs are for for high performance data analytics in memory database. And that's 48 terabytes of memory. 48 terabytes of DRAM memory. So the key there is it's you're accessing all of that 48 terabytes, you know, in the nanosecond scale, not in the millisecond scale if you're talking to traditional storage architectures. And what types of workloads are, are typically being used for a configuration like that? So probably the 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 uh, biggest use case we have is with SAP HANA. SAP with HANA has really been driving the move to to bring um, transaction processing and analytics processing together in memory, so that now not only can you you process transactions in real time, you can do your analytics in real time. So what this means is, from a business perspective, you're seeing how your business is operating today, not how it was operating last week or last month. So this lets you you know, drive your business in, in sort of more dynamically in real time to, to meet the needs of customers, see trends. So it's, it's you know, that real time capability through the in-memory is, is key to enabling that new use case. And for anybody who was previously using Superdome systems, is there, is there a path of migration to Flex? Yeah, what, what, the, the, what's, what's really nice is, you know, we have, it's exactly the same from a management perspective. The, the availability of the different operating systems, so whether you're interested in, in uh, Red Hat Linux, SUSE Linux, Oracle Linux, Windows, VMware, we provide all that capability. The management system is the same, we'll support the NPARs for partitioning the system, so you can have one rack with you know, 32 sockets, 48 terabytes, but you can also partition that into different use cases, so you could you could be running Oracle, you could be running SAP in, in different sections of the, of the same infrastructure. So, so it's, it's, it's an easy migration path. But again, the key is, you know, the previous generation Superdome X, while it was a great product, it was really optimized for 16 socket deployments. If you just wanted to start small, because it was a monolithic infrastructure, it was a, you know, a higher cost entry point. Now with the, the modular design, you can just start with that four socket box, but now as your business needs grow, you can add, add capability. Nice, thanks Mike. Thank you.